everyone. This is Leah from the Race Center, and these are Tyler boots from the rec department. Pulling them up, see if he makes it, and here we go. Hi, Leah. <laughs> Hi, Tyler. <laughs> um, it's an exciting day because uh, I made it out of my driveway and down the mile of dirt road that leads to the pavement uh, in Rumney. And um, here in northern New England, uh, it's a special time of year, uh, sometimes referred to as the fifth season uh, and mud season. And um, you may be able to guess why it's referred to as mud season. Um, but the reason that it happens is uh, pretty cool. You know, there are uh, a couple a couple regions in, in the world where it happens more, and they have a couple things in common. Um, one is fairly recent glaciation. So, you know, glaciers were here 12 to 14,000 years ago. So there's not much soil between the bedrock and the sky. Um, so, you know, thin, rocky soils with a bit of clay. Um, and those all help contribute to the mud that we see at this time of year. And it happens after the snow is melting and the ground starts to thaw and the ground starts to thaw from the top down to the bottom. So the bottom layers of the soil are still frozen and the top layers, the, the ice that has been there, the frozen soil is starting to release its water, but it can't percolate down through the soil uh, that is frozen below, so it sits right on top. And additionally, these trees and plants are not taking up a lot of water and you know transpiring it out through the leaves so they're not moving water uh, the water isn't moving down into the ground so the water just sits right on top and makes these amazing muddy conditions and um, the good news is if you like mud um, there's probably going to be more because there uh, as the amount of time when there's no snow coverage and there is warm and cold temperatures uh, that just extends mud season and so now we get um, you know quite a few more days of mud season than we had even 20 years ago here in this part of the world um, but you know it's uh, this too will change and the ground will continue to thaw out it'll percolate it'll go into the streams the trees and the plants will start to take it up and the soil will dry out eventually Sounds great. Until then, enjoy the month. <laughs> That's right. 